Hello everybody, my name is Topreva and welcome back to some more Civilization Beyond Earth playing as Brasilia. Um, putting the hurt on China, I think we're about to get them completely wiped off this planet. All the anti-orbital strikes are of course active again. Sending some ships across the ocean. What's this? That's a Franco-Iberian destroyer actually. Okay. Interesting to know that they also are sailing around, of course. Another trade in and uh, trade convoy, not envoy, it's a convoy. Um, through battleships, well, let's get some of my tanks ready to shoot that city. Can you already shoot? Oh, yeah, oh, you can hit the city even, that's that's a lot better. Um, set next to it for now. We'll just take some more shots at the city. Um, actually, you move in one, and then you're gonna shoot it, so I can move another one in to shoot it. Um, probably not gonna be able to hit it from there, but we have quite a few units next to it. Oh, now I actually feel sad for defeating her. She's all extremely sad and droopy. Oh, now she's looking at me like, no. No doubt our other colonies on other worlds have fared better than we. Um, yeah, let's create a puppet. Oh, wow, now we are 20 health again. That city is worth it. Um, let's actually see at the city what it has in this sense of wonders. It has the drone sphere. Uh, that's not a lot. But yeah, China is out of the game now. Um, you can just heal up. Also f destroyed all those... Uh, well, kind of annoying uh, uh, satellites because they were keeping, they were constantly giving those uh, points about it. Um, fine, okay, you go there. I'll have the other one go the other way. Uh, let's kill some sea dragons. It's a free. It's a little bit of free XP if it wasn't already at max anyway. Yeah, let's get another Terrascape online. Let's put you here on alert mode. Let's put you on intercept. That would be an I. Um, yes, Magrail. Should be one of the last pieces of Magrail. Yeah, it is the last piece of Magrail. So you can just build me a mine. And you can go all the way over here. I've turns just to get there. Uh, same thing with you, just seven. You finished your mine, it appears. Let's upgrade that tile. Throw battle suits. Um, let's get you over there. Heal up, heal up. You're healed already, so I will put you over here somewhere. We'll see later where we exactly put everything. I also want some stuff on the border with uh, Ark, just in case they decide to get crazy. And um, we're currently allied with uh, Franco-Iberia, sort of, while well, we're good friends. Hmm, not even really. They condemned me last turn, so there's that. Um, you can actually go the other way around, I suppose. Takes way too long to get there, though. Fine, I'll go there and see what it ends up. Think tank, um, sure, give us more health. Apparently, we only have one neural lab, so uh, something has arrived. Uh, one of them, yeah, reassign you. Um, Vanguard is Ark, one of their last cities. Yeah, we're just gonna call him back home. Eduardo is coming back to the uh, home front. So have energy establishing network in Uspec. Um, over here we get. Um, no, it's two floatstone. I don't want to spend more floatstone right now. Oh, Gene Garden sounds good. And your warden. Oh, wow! They actually managed to get a unit up again there. Uh, Centurion, keep moving. There we go. 
keep us a little bit busy. Oh, we've been condemned by the Slavic Federation. How unexpected. And Jesus, city connections. So many of them. Is it? Um, maybe because we now, yeah, we own a river connection and now we own the roads here. All, all the mag rail as well. Probably through that it's connected now. Oh, we've completed the Exodus Gate. So that should give us a new quest. Um, victory update. Um, the Promised Land. What do we have to do to win? Um, settle the Earthling refugees. So the Warp Gate stands ready as do our people. Soon the Earthlings will step foot into onto that which is their birthright. A new and glorious world for which we have long labored. They will be afraid, uncertain, but we will be waiting, arms open, ready to guide them into the future. As we speak, the people of Earth are making their way through the warp gate. They will be like the lambs, vulnerable and ill-equipped to face the dangers of the world. They need not fret, for we are their shepherds, and thus have prepared the way for their salvation. Their survival is all that matters, and so we must guide them to the settlements, that they may acclimate themselves and prepare to inherit paradise. Interesting. I wonder what it exactly means. We have to do domination. We... Hang on. Conquer all other players' capitals. Apparently, only um, we, uh, Franco Iberia, and uh, KP can still do that. But we're all on 71% because I own most capitals. Well, I own all capitals besides the one, uh, one of the two, one of these two. Transcendence, they're actually working on that as well. Emancipation, we are both the same level as Arc. And no one is working on contact as anyway. Oh, wow. They might be building a uh, mind uh, thing that we built in our previous Let's Play. Um, don't ask me for the exact name right now. But uh, that's basically how we will win that one. I sure a civil crash. The veteran sees as well through left tank. Oh yeah, let's send some tanks across the ocean. They are a lot faster across the ocean. That's fair though. Heal up for a turn or so. Um, you can go there. You Actually, I would like some more exploring going on as well while we're at it. You're not fully healed. Worker just built mine here. I'm not even sure if that was in city range, but... Eh, might as well have not there, um, sure, go to our capital. And keep on moving. And you're gonna join him. That's just amazingly beautiful. The units with uh, hover mode. That can just simply cross the ocean without any sort of issue. And here are a few heals needed. You can get on the water as well. Heal up. Um, I'm gonna put you back in our capital, I guess. Might as well, you know. Um, sure, let's go to. No, no, no. Ah, sure, previous ride, even better. I was looking for the previous ride, couldn't find it. I was like, damn it. Then I found it. Ha. Uh, Constructed dome. Oh, hello there. Um, go here and shoot that dragon. Warden, keep moving. Now you can get onto that island. <laughs> Wonder how easy it'll be to take out a Kraken with a left tank. That's the real question, really. Will that be easy or not? You build, just build an academy. Keep busy for a while, I guess. Uh, Zeno Cavalry, probably, oh, I was probably sending them exactly to that tile. Go me. Managing that. I just laugh and laugh very well. It's not like I brought you back from non-existence or anything. You know? Made um. of chitin, storm and lightning. How's your garden growing? Ah! Miasma mist and beetle hiss? And siege worms in a row. Affinity level 18. Our humans are one family. 
Those who are not of our family are not human. Amen. Amen, we say to you. Let them not test our forbearance. Nice. Maximum affinity achieved. Um, that bring Yeah, that was the achievement that I got. Getting the affinity level for uh, purity in this case. Already done harmony, so we would need... We did harmony, right? Yeah, we did the mind flower. That's what I was forgetting. And we got the mind flower built last uh, playthrough. And that's uh, for uh, that hill. And you go into the city, actually. We can use some people in the city as well. Um, taking Vanguard would actually give us a much better vantage point as well into KP, but we'll be fine for now. I know that tile is empty. Can use some left tanks here as well. And since they elevate, they can just basically go onto the water anyway. It doesn't matter. So let's take out. Wow, 63. So two left tanks would be enough to take out one Kraken. Basically. Which is actually pretty damn strong. And you're gonna help out. You're probably also pretty strong at taking them out, so. All the little bits help right now. Um, let's, yeah, let's start with some more home trade routes, to say the least. And just to make sure we don't, oh, they cannot do that. Eh, yeah, sure, let's go to Mandira. A Dragoon. And you can go rebase. Oh, that did not work. Well, it's Alt R, but apparently the right Alt button doesn't. Hello, Lev Destroyer. Uh, let's see, can I just. Yeah. What? I think I will need to send it to the east. Go through here. Doesn't take that many turns to get somewhere with this guy either. Even though they only have a movement of two. The only good bug is that bug. I finally killed 500 aliens as well. That took some time. Unlocked an upgrade. The true left destroyer. Wow, he gets even stronger. Um, range strength plus attack when attack plus percentage when attacking. Splash damage as well. And it gets one range with full health or even more splash damage. Your range is what, like two right now? Um, let's make that range increase then. Yeah. Here we go. True love destroyers. Um, research. Let's get some f stuff filled out, really. Some cheaper stuff. Like ballistics and defense, grid, power systems as well. Just single turn researches for a bit. Filling out what we don't have yet. Bionics lab. Um, yeah, we have Rezzel in here. That might be useful. Biofuel fuel plant. And a hollow matrix. Probably have some deorbiting people again happening soon anyway. Okay, there. Um, you can go here for now. And next turn again. We'll even get research now, which is funny. I think it's funny getting research in one turn. That's late game stuff. Oppression, chaos, and death may come from the barrel of a gun. But so occasionally does victory. Yes, that's a quote by us, basically. This is also it, it just looks ridiculous seeing your army just go across the ocean without problems at all. And it's fine. It's really great, but it's also a little bit strange to say the least. Um, yeah, these guys are upgrading everything. Ah, good point. I need to repair that tile. Uh huh. Oh, oh, there are the Kraken. They're all here. Sort of. 
Um, so we're making a detour with this guy. Oh, hello, there's another one. Um, they do not have a lot of movement, which is, of course, an advantage. <laughs> um, yeah, you can go there and then alert for now. Probably send someone there earlier now that I think of it. So, Hollow Matrix. Let's see. Any free city? We do have free cities, but... Hmm. Let's drop it on Ganzori. 531 culture turn. That is freakishly high. Gene Garden. Already have a Gene Garden. Oh, well, Guy and Well is just straight up energy. And uh, we barely got back to zero energy per turn as it is. That might make me happy. And it's killed again. That's 50 out of 100 nests cleared for the achievement as well another left tank gets going uh, dome is for culture manuel and santo adrio oh wow actually trying to push back now you know what just go in this city can have some defense going in places where i don't really need it omnipresent but and effective security measures make even the worst neighbors tolerable but the simple fact is we have such a big army now that micromanaging everything gets a bit of a drag. Um, yeah, let's go that way and there. More tanks coming in. Actually, hang on, can I just... Well, okay, so they can even set up on the water. That's just, that's really ridiculous. My artillery units can just set up on water. You go away. You kill the sea dragon with ease. Mm -hmm. Just alert there so I know if there's anything going to happen. I'm sure. Let's build an array. It looks good. So on the end of the small peninsula there. Let's go to Manuel. Units are getting everywhere. One of you needs to go that way. Um, yeah, you can build your mag rail. So I can actually send the guy there. Um, no, just a farm. <laughs> um, yeah, an alien preserve. I haven't built that one yet. That's not great. Anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. Make sure to like if you enjoyed and subscribe if you want to keep up to date in the future. Oh. Mm. Okay, so finishing the Exodus gate, I'm going to summon an Earthling Settler. Um, let's click the gate again if I can. Actually, let's see, what does it say? Um, Earthling Settlers follow the same rules as colonists and outposts when founding an Earthling Settlements. They can also be used to increase the population of existing earthling settlements. Ah, so you're going to build new cities for people from Earth. That's actually pretty cool. And you only have one movement as well, so you really have to prepare. Um, in that case, you stop building your farm for now and build me a mag rail on the Exodus Gate. But yeah, again, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys later.